You've been misled. Spiders aren't the terrifying creatures people make them out to be. Despite their reputation, they pose little to no threat to humans. In fact, they might just be your greatest ally. Out of nearly 50,000 known species of spiders, only about a dozen have venom potent enough to cause any real harm to humans. That's a fraction of a fraction. The vast majority of spiders are completely harmless and have no interest in biting you. Take the Black Widow, for example. Its venom is powerful, but fatalities from its bite are exceedingly rare. Modern medicine ensures that even the worst cases are treatable. In reality, you're far more likely to suffer a severe reaction from a bee sting than from a black widow bite. And then, there's the infamous brown recluse. While its bite can cause necrotic tissue in rare cases, studies show that many reported recluse bites were actually infections or other skin conditions. The fear of these spiders far outweighs the actual risk. The truth is, most spiders don't even have fangs strong enough to pierce human skin. Their venom is designed for insects, not people. Even if a spider does bite, it's usually a last resort, not an act of aggression. Spiders are naturally reclusive creatures. They would rather run than fight. If you've ever heard stories of people waking up with spider bites, chances are those weren't spider bites at all. The reality is spiders don't sneak into beds to bite people at night. They have no reason to. Studies show that the majority of mysterious spider bites are actually caused by other insects, skin irritations, or bacterial infections. Yet the fear persists. Arachnophobia is one of the most common fears in the world but it's largely based on myth and misinformation. Hollywood and urban legends have exaggerated the danger of spiders to the point that many people believe they're far deadlier than they actually are. The idea of spiders crawling into our beds and attacking us is pure fiction. A spider's primary focus is survival, and that means avoiding large, unpredictable creatures like humans. What most people don't realize is that spiders play a crucial role in our environment. They are nature's pest control, silently keeping insect populations in check. Without them, we'd be overrun by mosquitoes, flies, and even cockroaches. A single spider can consume hundreds of insects in its lifetime. Some species, like the common house spider, prefer to live indoors because of the steady food supply. They aren't there to harm you. They're actually protecting you from far worse pests. In agricultural settings, spiders help farmers by reducing the number of crop-destroying insects. They limit the need for pesticides, making them an essential part of natural pest management. Even in urban areas, they help control disease-carrying insects. Studies have shown that homes with spiders have fewer pests, which can reduce the spread of bacteria and viruses. Instead of being feared, spiders should be appreciated for the role they play in maintaining ecological balance. Then there's the myth that larger spiders are more dangerous. Size doesn't necessarily indicate a stronger venom. In fact, some of the biggest spiders, like tarantulas, have venom that's harmless to humans. Despite their intimidating appearance, tarantulas are known for their docile nature. Many people even keep them as pets. The Australian huntsman spider, another large species, prefers to run from humans rather than bite. Even if it did bite, its venom is mild and causes nothing more than temporary discomfort. One of the most persistent myths is that spiders lay eggs under human skin. This has never happened. Spiders do not see humans as hosts for their offspring. Their reproductive process requires specific environmental conditions that human bodies simply do not provide. The idea of baby spiders bursting out of someone's skin is pure horror fiction, not reality. Another common misconception is that killing a spider is the best way to get rid of them. In truth, removing spiders from your home can actually make pest problems worse. When you kill a spider, you eliminate one of the most effective natural predators of insects. Without them, mosquitoes, flies, and cockroaches have fewer obstacles, allowing their populations to grow unchecked. Instead of squashing them, consider relocating them outdoors. If you truly can't stand the sight of spiders, sealing entry points and reducing clutter can help keep them out without resorting to extermination. Despite their bad reputation, some cultures revere spiders. In many Native American traditions, spiders symbolize wisdom and creativity. In African folklore, Anansi the spider is a clever trickster who teaches valuable lessons. Even in modern science, spider silk is being studied for its incredible strength and potential applications in medicine and engineering. The more we learn about spiders, the more we realize just how fascinating and beneficial they really are. Even the deadly reputation of the Brazilian wandering spider, often called the most venomous spider in the world, is largely exaggerated. While its venom is potent, bites are extremely rare, and fatalities are almost non-existent due to the availability of antivenom. 
It's not an aggressive hunter of humans, it's simply a spider trying to navigate its environment like any other creature. In reality we live alongside spiders every day without even noticing them. Studies suggest that at any given time there are likely dozens of spiders within a few meters of you, yet, they go unseen, quietly doing their job of keeping insect populations under control. If spiders were truly as dangerous as people think, we'd have far more encounters with them. The fact that we don't speaks volumes about their true nature. So the next time you see a spider consider pausing before you react with fear. The odds are overwhelmingly in your favor that it means you no harm. In fact, it might just be helping you more than you realize. Spiders aren't the villains they've been made out to be, they are essential, misunderstood creatures that play a vital role in our world. Once you understand the truth it's hard not to see them in a whole new light. Now that you've learned some amazing spider facts we want to hear from you. What do you think about these eight-legged creatures? Are they fascinating or terrifying? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more exciting animal facts coming your way.